Good day everyone and welcome. Before we start, we have a disclosure. Please be aware of risk in the future trading. At this moment, it's only 12.58 Eastern Time and uh, it's a Monday. Uh, usually Monday are slow, but let me show you uh, today what happening uh, on the uh, ES. Not much really. If we look at the 9.30 morning, um, this is the 9.30 morning. You can see how the market had dropped a little bit, got projected, keep going down, and there is really not much trending. And look, it is long, short, long, short, long, short. So all those signals, you can see uh, they are very tight. You have a long signal, sell signal, buy signal, sell signal, reversal, buy signal. So it is really uh, not much going on so far, but it seems like the momentum uh, is start getting stronger. And we are about to hit the institutional number and profit taken. But there is not much action and there is no really uh, great news at this moment to spike the market. Uh, despite that, uh, we are done for today and uh, we still have a trade uh, on the CL on the 500 ticks and we still have a tr trade on the 10 range uh, on the CL. We still have the gold uh, one minute is doing fine. And uh, we still have the ES is on one trade. This is a one minute, you know, so this is a really uh, very good. Uh, also from uh, the market analyzer, uh, we have five different automated trade. They're doing extremely well for a slow day today. Uh, as an example, we can take uh, the NASDAQ is coming uh, from the market analyzer. And here it is. But the market analyzer is based on one contract and it is it just hit 100 tick and this one here the auto trade is based on two contract so it's a double the amount of the market analyzer because the market analyzer is on one lot uh, the same story uh, for the YM uh, took that trade and it is based on two contracts and they're doing fine and um, and uh, here is your target and this auto trade you can extend the target to the higher level if you want uh, if you want you can break even and leave it alone and then the auto trade will readjust your trading stop based on the fib lines so this is even if you don't want to do anything uh, if you want to leave it alone uh, if the the market is trending the auto trade uh, extend the target for higher uh, uh, target and um, uh, for for the goal today uh, hit the target um, at uh, 10 30 morning and uh, it hit 1 1400 and the nasdaq 400 takes also i mean this is not bad for monday uh, finish around 10 o'clock and uh, this is a really really good uh, also, we have the NASDAQ 10 range uh, did very well as 1500 and it finished around 931. We started around uh, uh, 845 and uh, this one here, it finished uh, at 10 o'clock and the first trade was 9943. So you can see um, that the auto trades did not use that much time. And there and uh, uh, on the YM one minute to 2800 and the NASDAQ the 500 finished at around 10 o'clock all, all the NASDAQs finished uh, doesn't matter which uh, time frame they finish around 10 o'clock and uh, the uh, 10 1020 this one here the YM the, the YM lately has been competing with the NASDAQ and um, uh, 947 on the NASDAQ 9 range. This is not bad. 
and on the YM 400 takes a finish around 1029 with a 30 uh, 80 and um, uh, the YM on the 9 range finished around 1019 1620 and then uh, we have the YM 2 minutes 1300 this is not bad at all and um, the YM on 8 range 30, uh, 1230 uh, finish around 10 you can see all of them they finish around the 10 o'clock and now we we just sit down and uh, just you know this is something uh, for the market analyzer if we you don't have to trade everything but let's say uh, from the market analyzer you want to trade uh, ES or micro ES or NASDAQ and YM uh, so we don't need to trade all the instruments so at this moment um, based on two contract uh, we have 375, 150, and 830 based on two contract. But if you only wanted to trade one contract, you have 150, 355, and $70. But this is uh, just from the last entry signal, not the whole day. This is the last entry signal. And you don't have to trade all the instrument. Actually, this is the uh, enjoyable uh, part of trading if you've been manual trading god forbid saying this word because many people don't like to manual trade or you know that's fine but uh, for people they've been around it is actually enjoyable because you can um, you can fuzzle with the auto trade you can break even you can extend the target and you let the auto trade take the trade and then when the market uh, comes to your turn and stop, it, it readjusts itself if you don't want to do anything. And if the market is trending, it's going to go ahead, the auto trade, extend the target automatically, which in a way you can interfere with it or in a way you don't have to. Folks, that's all what we have. Right now is 106 and uh, we are done for today practically. Uh, and uh, we say thank you very much and please be careful for the rest of the day. Bye for now.